So I've had some requests for a beauty room tour, so I figured I would pop on and do that real quick. Um, <clears throat> it's mostly clean. <laughs> there needs to be some dusting done up there. Um, so on the wall behind my vanity, I have all of my mostly indie palettes, but some other random palettes as well. Um, my husband and I painted this glitter wall, mostly him, uh, <laughs> after he had wrist surgery. So it was with one arm and I think he did pretty good. <laughs> um, it looks better in the sunlight or in direct light. The edges did not turn out too well, but that's okay. Um, over there I have my, um, perfume bottles from my grandmother, um, that has since passed away. And then let's go through um, drawer by drawer. So the vanity is from Impressions Vanity and um, they messed up and, and sent an extra two sets of drawers, which is not what we asked for, but um, I ran with it. So here I have all of my blushes. So I have um, the powder blushes here and then in the front of the drawer, I have the cream products. And then here I have bronzers and highlights, same with um, powder and then cream products in the front. And then in this drawer, I have um, when my makeup erasers are clean, which I just need to go grab them from the drying rack. Um, they go in here and then these are for washing the sponges. And then I have an extra set back here and an extra sponge that I got for Christmas. Um, on that shelf down there, I don't have anything right now, but my um, brush washing stuff goes in there. I don't have it in there right now because I've been washing brushes. So in here um, on the top left part is my everyday makeup drawer. This is everything that I have in projects are typically in here and here and then this is like my shop my stash stuff for the most part um so in here i do have uh, um <clears throat> some flower beauty things i was kind of gathering everything for a full face video to see what else i might need um the next drawer down i have setting sprays and primers and then i have um foundations and powders and my sponges that are clean. In here I have um, Beach Cosmetics and a few other miscellaneous more affordable palettes. And then in the bottom I have my skincare stuff. So like um, body scrubs which actually I need to pull one out for my shower. So I have body scrubs and masks and things like that. So in the center drawer, I have um, all of my face palettes um, on the bottom. And then in the top, I have all of my fun things like super shocks, um, glitters, cream shadows. Um, I do keep um, this Plain Jane Remastered palette here in the top drawer because it's more topper shades to me. And then I do the same with these two because these, I would use these like I do my super shocks. So I don't keep them with my regular palettes and it has helped me to use them more. Up on top of my vanity, I have my brushes. These are in like a pen holder. <laughs> Um, and then I have my, whoop, I have my foundation and concealer brushes. So these are anything I would mostly use with cream products. Um, I have a little handheld mirror here, which um, can unfold and lay flat if you would like. And then um, I have my micellar water setting sprays that I'm trying to work on, a lotion. I have my skincare um, that is not in my skincare fridge. 
Um, I do have a phone holder here and when I'm in the beauty room, um, I use it for my phone just to kind of like watch or listen to music. And then when I'm not in my beauty room, I put the remote for the mirror there so that I don't lose it. The mirror is gorgeous. Um, over here, I have like a little trinket box I got for Christmas. And then um, this is a thing that my husband brought back when he had a layover in Paris when he was going overseas. Um, my Q-tips in case I need to clean something up. Um, here I have pens and tools to like scrape out the last bit of things and all of my headbands that I wear um, to pull my hair back. I do have like a more, you know, professional like salon clippy, but I like the fun stuff. This I do use to straighten my hair though. Um, I don't usually have products sitting out unless I'm just being messy, which let's face it is pretty frequently, but this is everything that is in my Peony Cats and Dogs project pan. Um, I just need to make sure that I got accurate weights on them and put them away in my everyday makeup drawer. Um, I do have a fan. Um, the only problem with this is that it's rechargeable and I'm terrible at charging it, but um, I absolutely love it. On the right side, on top, I have my palettes that I have picked out for my Shop My Stash and also any palettes that are new that I haven't tried yet. Um, I like to keep them front and center so that I can grab for them whenever I'm ready to try a new palette. <clears throat> and also to remind myself that I don't need more. Um, the next drawer down, I keep most of my eye stuff. So I have mascara, eye primers, brow products, everything that I'm currently working on as far as like brows and mascara. And then I have some tools and um, some other Things. These are for lip gloss, and then those are for um, putting on shimmery eyeshadow that sometimes is better with one of those foam applicators. The next drawer down is just eyeliners. And then I have my more higher end palettes. And then finally, in the bottom, I have ColourPop. This ColourPop drawer used to be completely full and I decluttered quite a bit of it. So we're not looking so full now. Over here, I have um, extra decor that I kind of change out in my background. And then I have this, um, this is new. Uh, it's like an office organizer, but it matches the pen holder. And um, I have my painting notebooks that I put there. Um, okay, let's, can we track back this way, please? And then I have my um, palettes that I've used this month that I use for palette roundup. I have some palettes on the chopping block here that I'm kind of thinking about what I want to do with. Um, I have my playing cards for deck of panning, my scale, and then an extra sharpener that I haven't used yet. In these drawers, I have my lips. Oh, there's my other. <laughs> I've been searching for this tripod because the one I'm using now can be a little finicky. Um, so here are my bullet lipsticks and liquid lips. And then in here are lip glosses, lip treatments, and lip liners. In this drawer, we have empties and also things that I plan to put in a giveaway or pass along. And then in the bottom drawer are just bags and then a silk tablecloth that I use to sometimes take pictures or um, do overheads with. So swinging around to my right is um, a window that looks out into my backyard over a trampoline that my kids jump on. <laughs> and then behind me is my background that you see when I am filming. Um, I have all of my nail stuff and then my skincare caddy. 
a few things in the background. So <laughs> this says, you're an angel in the pit with your hands in the air. My husband gave me that for Christmas. It is lyrics from a Third Eye Blind song and he is taking me to a Third Eye Blind concert in the front row. Pray for me. Um, so you'll see in the background a lot of times this light because I'm too lazy to keep like flipping it up. Also, I don't wanna break it, <laughs> but this is an overhead light that I use whenever I do overhead videos on this vanity. This is my old one um, that I don't really use anymore. We took the back of it off and um, it's been really good for being in the background. In here, I have like zit treatment, um, random tools. It's, it's a really random assortment of things. A microphone that is absolute crap that I tried to use. In this cabinet, we have nails and lashes and then um, some empty magnetic palettes and some nail things like stickers and stuff. Up here on the shelves that are behind me when I film, um, I don't have a lot on these shelves. I eventually would like to have a few more things, but um, I have my perfumes on each shelf and then I just have a few like cute little little things up here these used to be um plants that I got for Mother's Day but I kill everything green so maybe not the best idea and then of course also behind me is a door I do dislike that there's a door behind me when I'm doing my makeup sometimes but you know what I'm just thankful to have a beauty space. Um, I do have some extra lighting equipment and stands and stuff back there. And then I have this nail polish shelf that I used to have full and I don't know what I want to do with it. I don't know what I want to do with that space. I'm still thinking on it. And then a beautiful mirror that my husband hung up for me. So that is my beauty room. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you.